So the Hive just added a feature that we haven't seen on the Hive for 11 months now. And also we have some cool Sky Wars maps and Treasure Wars maps and a Hive Hub reskin. As you can see the leaves are falling down and they look amazing. We even have a couple of hedgehogs over here singing and dancing. And over here right next to the deer we have an owl for some reason. While the Hive Hub looks beautiful and, and amazing, there is one thing that they have sadly removed and that is the crabs and beans thing. I am so sad that they have removed this as I really want to do it more on my streams and everything. So Hive, please add something similar to this. Uh, one suggestion I could give is like a bush and for it to come out like a different animal, like a rabbit or, or a deer or something interesting. Please Hive, add that back in. But the main feature that we're looking for isn't in the Hive Hub, it's actually in Hive Skywars, yeah. Basically Hive Skywars got a couple of seasonal maps that include Harvest and Campsite. The, only those two maps have been transformed into their seasonal theme right now, but nevertheless they look amazing too. So Campsite is a cool looking map, but we're not going to focus on Harvest. The main feature that we are looking for is the Honey Block, yes. The honey block hasn't been seen on the hive since last year during the autumn season of 2020. It's been added in Hive Skywars and it's been used, but sadly they removed it once the Christmas update came around. But finally, it's back. There are a couple of interesting things you can do with the honey block. One of the main ones, which pretty much everyone is going to do, especially the purple grape man, is trapping with them. There are a couple of traps that you can do with them as you can see right now. Some are more harder to make than others, but all of them are really fun to create. While doing honey block traps is all well and good, there's actually something else that you can do with these honey blocks, and that is to hit people through them. Basically, the hitboxes on honey blocks aren't the same as a hitbox on any other block. You can hit people through them, and as you can see, this could lead up to some very interesting things, especially in trapping. Of course, also honey blocks work in the standard way that they do, which is every time when you touch them, you slide on them, and you can't really jump on them, unless you can do this. As you can see, I'm trying all my hardest to get up the staircase, and I can barely make it. So it is technically somewhat possible to jump on the hive's honey block, but it's kind of difficult. If for sliding, you can definitely use it for some more trapping or I guess you would call it honey trapping people when they're running across a bridge trying to get you. I also tried to see if it was possible to get kicked by the anti cheese on the honey block just because the honey block isn't a perfect block and sometimes you can get kicked by the anti cheat as you know that potato pie once got kicked to using a slime block. Sadly for now I don't think it is possible to get kicked by the anti cheat because of the honey block. They probably either fixed it or it's just not possible but you never know. See if you can find any other uses you can do with the honey block because I feel like there's a, a bit more than I think there are. Now at the end this update is all well and good. We got a new hub and we got a couple of new features and maps but I can't wait for the Halloween update. The update should be coming around soon and I can't wait to make and see what the hive gives us for it. We're probably gonna have a hunt for it and maybe a ghost invasion to be back in to the game roster. And maybe just the maybe we could even see the new Skywars levels and Skywars kits update coming around the Halloween time as we've been wanting them for so long and finally we have both of them announced. The Hive Twitter is kind of teasing something so maybe we will see them during Halloween but I don't know. I'm hoping for anything at this point. And that's gonna be it for today's episode. I want to thank you all very much for watching. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts on the Hive update and if you want to watch one more of these videos YouTube recommends this one on screen right now. And make sure you also subscribe. Thanks for watching.